Now they have escorted us to the main park road. Hello, hello! So, guess what? We're going to Wales to hike somewhere. It should be less than two hours, total drive time. And now we did almost an hour, maybe even more than an hour. And we have still two hours, 15 minutes left. And we're stopping again. Yay! Not yay. Don't stop me. I'm having a good time. Having a good time. We have just parked. And unfortunately, because of the traffic, uh, we don't have much time today. Oh, that place feels so nice. Yep. Many rocks. Very nice rock. Look at this. Oh man, that's probably the best rock here. It's a different kind of fact. Yeah, I know. The drug business Start is cool. Up. Like I'm, I have a new idea of a drug startup. It's called Inject Me. Uh, <laughs> it has an app. Yes, but the me, however, this is important yeah. to get across for copyright reasons. The me is spelled with two e's. So if any of you have copy me, uh, good, not not very good things are going to happen to you. But yeah, the basic idea is you have an app. Yeah. And it's a lot like Uber. Yeah. Uh, oh no no, no. Uh, more like Deliveroo. Okay. For so drugs. And so you select what you want, the amount. Somebody comes over, delivers it to you. It deliver, delivers it to you or to your bloodstream. Uh, can, can you can you offer? Uh, that's a premium service. For all professional, yeah. Professional. Like if, if you're scared, it's a first time. Anyway, we're going to camp somewhere. Hopefully, we'll hopefully be there in about 45 minutes. 45 minutes. That should be not too bad. No. At it, least at least for me because my backpack is literally the same 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 one. Uh, as we did in Lake District. Yes. Just, I mean, this one is a bit heavier because I'm carrying also a, a volleyball and some snacks because, uh, well, I don't know why. Oh, look, this tree has a dick. Really mature. It's been such a like long time since I've just like mm. seen beach sand. I literally cannot see anything because this light is glaring to my to my camera, so I'm just going by sound. I was swimming. Uh, it was really nice swim, actually. Took all my stuff back to the place where we're supposed to camp, and someone was shining light to me. And apparently, there were park rangers because apparently it's national park and you can cannot camp in here. Uh, and yeah. So now they have escorted us to the main park road. It's a bit of a shame because it was really, really beautiful in there. But I hope we'll go there tomorrow without all the backpacks and everything and without tents. So yeah, I guess that's the evening update. I'm, I'm good for tomorrow's night. <laughs> Finally, first proper food of the day. So it seems we found a place new place and there's a reason why we are going through you know just like that because without the backpacks because we will be sleeping just in our sleeping bags no tents allowed well we didn't say about sleeping bags
So guess what? Good morning or good night, I guess. Both at the same time because oh, because uh, it's raining pretty badly at the moment and it's 4 a.m. in the morning and we are going back to the car because we are wet. Oh wow, it's getting worse. Adventure is shaped, shaped like, like a. Stick with the long this, Morning. So, oh, we woke up around, I don't know, 20 minutes before this. So, at night, as I don't know if it. If I recorded that or not because I was really sleepy uh, it started raining so our wild wild camping spot was compromised so fortunately we had to just walk the car and just literally slept in the car it's all right I mean it wasn't the most comfortable thing to do that wild sleeping spot was much much more comfortable but yeah, we slept in the car and now we're, we will be heading for breakfast in on the seaside. Looks alright. Wait. Fucking hell, it's cold now. It's very cold. It's very, very cold. That's why I, why I was like considering not going yet. Yeah. So it's the second day of our little adventure, and this is the beach where I was swimming yesterday. It's Wales Mountains, because the whole thing is just curves around. Uh, yeah. Uh, we played some volleyball thingy uh, and I don't know, we just we were just chilling and went for a swim but we couldn't go swim very far because uh, Jamie spotted a couple jellyfishes swimming around and those are as far as you know basically those are like really colorful ones and Usually in the nature goes that if thing is pretty, it's dangerous. <laughs> I mean, obviously it probably won't kill you, but it's just not nice to get, you know, stung by a jellyfish. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Walking bare barefoot, it's all well and nice and everything, uh, except when you start walking o over broken seashell footpath oh wow it's a bit steep <laughs> a little bit as you can probably see it's a bit rainy Oh damn boy, it's quite cold. Oh. Well, at least it's beautiful. So I lost my friends somewhere and I have no idea where they are actually. <laughs> but I'm on the quest to find them. Well, eventually I caught up with them. But luckily I had car keys, so they wouldn't have gone anywhere without me anyway. Nothing beats traditional road trip fish and chips, right? Yep. We're getting some food. Sadly, this was the last of whales we've seen for a while because of strict regional lockdowns. At the same time, these were the last two warm days this year anyway. 
Stay happy, guys. Bye.